Yes, people, what is going on? I hope everyone is well. Hats, scarves, got the gloves as well <laughs> inside the car. But yeah, lately, obviously, the weather is taking a turn. We're in Jan. We've got freezing temperatures around the corner. Uh, I'm in Aston today. I'm trying out a place called Burger Shack. It's been on my list, to be honest, uh, for a while. So I thought, you know what, let me just check it out. I think these lot are also value for money, but I gotta double check when I have a look at the menu and the prices when I get inside. It's in Aston. Big up to Aston as well. Big up to Aston Villa, my local football club in the heart of the Aston community. And my workplace is around the corner as well. In the school that I work at. So yeah, I am gonna do it in the car. It's absolutely freezing, so I need to quickly order and come back to the car and just munch away, man. So, Burger Shack, let me know in the comments if you've been here before. And then, yeah, we'll go have a look at the menu and then see what it's all about then. All right, come on then, let's do this. So, it's on uh, Trinity Road. So, there's the Villa Ground. Big up to Villa. At the moment, they're smashing it. And then, you come onto Trinity Road. And then, you go down there. It's a little tiny shop little tiny shop and then over here you've got Aston Park as well you got the football got you got the football pitch on uh, them side as well obviously it's dark you can't really see but down here Burger Shack small little shop it's tiny man a little hut a little unit so there we are Burger Shack there you go all right no seating available though. <laughs> Let's have a look then. Let's go inside. So here's the menu. You got classics and specials. There you go. Three pound, two pound, three pound, three eighty nine, three forty nine. Yeah, and then you got some burgers down here as well. Not bad for the prices, to be honest. But what shall I go for then? So I'm gonna have a look at the menu and then track on and inside. There's not that much seating available as you can see another thing is i forgot to bring my dji pocket 2 with me as well because i would have had my wireless mic because this was unplanned i was um, in aston around the end and obviously i got hungry as well and i thought you know what let me just try this place but that's one thing so but it's all, it's all right because i'm going to do the review inside the car anyway and uh, there's not going to be no noise ever whatsoever so that's the only thing i forgot uh, obviously the dji pocket 2 fits right in your pocket so i think what I need to do is every time I go out, out and about, I need to just place it in the pocket. <laughs> All right, we're ordered, um, and then we'll um, get, get back to the car and then tell you what uh, I've ordered as well. Then. All right, and then carry on. Cool. Okay, so I've come back to the car now. Yeah, the food is here. I'll give you a lot of background shots in terms of the food as well. Uh, so, three forty-nine, I think it was. Correct me if I'm wrong. With a background shot. All right. <laughs> Uh, with the burger meal, two pound, so five forty nine. What, what are you reckon about that? Let me know in the comments. And then I got a pepper shack, pe pepper, was it a pepper shack burger? Two beef patties, uh, forty grams each. Looks tiny though. So let's get stuck in then. Bismillah. Straight away. When the, the brother was putting uh, the chicken burger, chicken fillet burger on. To the onto the grill. I clocked straight away. They're going to be frozen. Um, they're going to be frozen chicken fillet patties. And uh, I did ask her, oh, "Don't you do like the southern fried chicken type?" And they go now. So we'll see how it is. Then this one left. Very crunchy, obviously very oily as well. The chicken is decent. The breading is giving me more of a, you know, the fish fillet, fish fillet burger that you get. The, the one from Mackey's or even like the ones that you get, I love Mackey's, boycott them, but the ones that you can get from like Aldi, the square fish fillet, 
burgers, the ones that you can make at home. It's got gherkins in there as well. And um, it's got some um, lettuce and also caramelised onions. When you want to have a chicken filler burger, you need that juicy, massive, chunky type chicken filler burger. So, you know what? This is just decent, man. You know what I'm saying? It gets, it'll, it'll get a pass just about. <laughs> to be honest with you, there's a lot of Uber drivers coming through, just to eat whatnot. A lot of d delivery drivers. But they were closed as well for a few months. I think these are the new owners. I don't know, is it because it wasn't popular within the community? I'm not sure. This is why the fries. Got some uh, Algerian sauce on there. And some uh, mayonnaise as well. Very thin fries. Fries are standard. I love the Algerian sauce and uh, mayonnaise. That complements the fries really well. But apart from that, the fries are standard. A bit disappointed in the chicken fillet burger, to be honest. It never gave me any, it never gave me a buzz, if you if you get me. But alhamdulillah for the food. If you're new to the channel, show some love and support by subscribing. Check out all the Munchbox videos that I've done. Thank you for your support on them ones. And also, thank you very much, all my subscribers. Bare love and respect goes out to you lot. For you lot. A part of me, team captain, you're all part of me. And as I say in football when I play, a team is nothing without everyone working together. And we've got to 4K now, mashallah, so thank you very much. What was the beef? What was that? Beef slash smash burger call, man, I forgot. I gotta put, uh, put a background shot in it again, but I forgot, I forgot. <laughs> The, not the burger shack. That's what the sh shop is called. <laughs> uh, the something shack, man. Oh, I can't believe this. Anyway, let's try it. Two forty gram patties in there. Beef patties. Very, very plain. Very bland. Yeah, no flavour. No flavour, to be honest. These are... These are, what's, what's my rating? Uh, below decent. Uh, average. Yeah, yeah, average, I think. A very quick one in Aston. Burger Shack. First time being here. A bit of a disappointment. A bit of a letdown, but Alhamdulillah for the food. Big up to the Aston community. <laughs> That's what's making me more happy. And Aston Villa. Being around the corner from the Villa Grand. So, I thought I thought this one would be value for money as well, but again, it was an unplanned review. Sometimes unplanned reviews happen as well. When you're in the ends, when you're around, in and around, somewhere, and you're fancy and munch, why not try different places? And that's what it's all about. So, let me know in the comments if you've been here before. Check out all the playlists, food reviews, vlogs, activities, all my YouTube shorts that I upload in terms of the techers. Captain loves football. And thank you very much for all the support. And we will see you on the next one then. Alright, bail of respect. Captain out, take care then.